Wilton in Wiltshire, world-famous rugs and carpets are made again. From designer's board via the old-style vat for dyeing wool to the hand-operated looms, factories get back into production after a war job making camouflage nets and kit bags. Wilton artisans have carried on this work since the 17th century. From a pattern pinned to the top of the strands, the finished rug is built up, every tuft tied by hand. Carpet-hungry Britain, suffering from bare floors and threadbare rugs, backs the drive in carpet making. Ex-servicemen come in for training as machine weavers. In the centre is Sergeant Goodman, ex-Arnim paratrooper and ex-prisoner of war. Power looms turn out strip carpet in 200-yard lengths, but demand is way ahead of supply. It's long since we saw any in the shops, so here's a reminder of what new carpet is really like. Yes, it looks good, but it'll look even better on somebody's stairs.